So yeah, what's going on with you and Patrick right now? Oh, we're just trying to figure it out. We decided to live apart because it's like we got to this point like in our relationship where it was just like roommates. There's a lot of shit going on in my life, especially with Patrick. We went from a long distance relationship to living with each other for a little while in New York to then living with each other in LA. It was like we went from zero to old married couple overnight. We were barely like having sex. We were like barely speaking to each other, like you fight. You had your routine. And it was just like, something needs to change. I get that. My only concern is that it's like an excuse to like break up without having the balls to break up. Stassi is slowly rolling down the mountain, <laughs> head over feet. She's on her way to rock bottom. And this is kind of her fault. I felt like I was codependent a little bit. A lot. On Patrick, and I just don't feel like fighting yeah. anymore with anyone. For two years, I've invested so much in Patrick that now I'm realizing that I've compromised a lot of my friendships and I handled things poorly, but I don't feel like it's completely my fault. And that's another reason I want to rectify like things that I, I shouldn't have done like last year and like... Katie. I mean, the whole Katie thing is, it's, it's super complicated. It's more complicated than my actual relationship because the whole sex tape thing, like, shook my world. After I broke up with Jax, I started dating this guy who I hear that he's showing tons of people a video of myself alone, touching myself. Like, Sheena was wrong. I know for a fact that she showed it to people. I know that she laughed about it, and that's not okay. Katie knew how hurt I was by Sheena. She knew how devastated I was. It's a big deal when you're going to Miami with the person who just showed my sex tape to everybody. It makes my life so happy. <laughs> One thing I've really learned about myself is that I have a great ability to just cut people out. I'm just hoping that she could take ownership for that. Yeah. I mean, I regret cutting her out so quickly. Especially now that I just, engaged. this is the thing, Kristen, I started crying. I was with my mom up in Lake Arrowhead and I was like, I was supposed to be there. Something's going on and I don't like it. I smell trouble. Just don't break any more hearts. I'm not getting any younger. I would like to settle down at some point. I'm sure people have warned you about me. 